Hello everybody, my name is David Pryden and this is Supreme Ruler 1936. We're going to go single player, sandbox mode, and we're going to pick a European country. Now, who shall we pick? We can pick many nations. We can pick uh, Luxembourg. They are not exactly like the best country to pick because they're like really tiny teeny. And so we're going to pick a country that we could probably play as for a while. Um, which one shall we pick? We can pick literally any. We've got 1941. So he could be Germany. Play as Hitler himself. Adora, which is like down here. It's kind of cute. Um, you got Usher all the way over here. It's Big Mama. So yeah, you shouldn't mess with them. Um, you got Vinci France, who are pretty much the vassals of Nazis, Germany. Um, yeah, so we're going to go for 1936. Actually, you know what? We're going to go for wi for the wi World at War, which is basically... Don't worry, it's not Nazi zombies. You you're not going to see any of them. I hope. <laughs> Alright. There's only three countries in Africa. How many was there in Africa? There's three countries in Africa, but there was four then. Wow. Okay. You could play as Egypt. That's something. You could play as Oceania. We could play as Australia. Play a little bit of Aussie. Oh, New Zealand. You could play as New Zealand, but I'm not really good for uh, Navy battles. You could play as the United States. So I'm going to go for a European country. Now, loads of people do European countries. Um, but you know what? I'm going to go for the United Kingdom. Where are we? There we are. So we're going to have a look at the options. Going to go for medium. New bonds. Uh, no new bonds. We don't we'll go for default. Approval standard. Um... Yeah, that one's good. I'm just doing this because sometimes it like does loads eliminate units when region falls. Yes. Okay. I do apologise. I'm just trying to get all this done. Uh, normal, normal, normal. We're all going to keep this normal. Start game without any units. Now nah, I'm going to keep it as it is. So yeah, that should be good. We're going to play as the United Kingdom. So this should be awesome. Um, it's a game which is quite interesting. It's kind of like the Paradox games of Crusader Kings and stuff like that. I haven't really touched on any sort of games like this. So I thought I'd touch on a little game like this. Wow, okay. That's a bit in my face. Okay. So if we minimise this, we should be able... How do we start the day? We're going to go for fast. Ist. So, we have some stuff here. We have some stuff here. First thing we want to do, though, is pause the game. Zoom out. I know it's a bit hectic. We've got to test... We, we have terrible relations with Russia. So, we've got to check our relations with everyone else. We have brilliant relations with France, though. So, if we go to here, you can buy technologies. They are extremely expensive. Um, criminals. Non-aggressive. Aggressive, missile defense, free trade, free flow of labor, and a formal alliance. And apparently France don't want that because they're being dicks at the moment. No no offense to any French people, I do apologize. Just that for some reason you don't really like me. And apparently I have to buy my way in. That's rubbish. Who else likes me? Anyone like me? Um, Not really. No one really likes me. <laughs> wow, okay. What about you, America? You like the United... No, you apparently don't. Okay. Oh, wow, you hate me. Really bad. Okay, criminal extension. No, you don't even want that. Wow. Free trade. No, you don't want that. Wow, you're such a dick. What about you, Canada? You're a vassal. Free fur of labor. Missile defense. Mutual defense. And criminal... Yeah. That would do great. That, that, that'll that help me out great, dude. And what about Australia? Oh, I have land. Hello. He's a vassal, though. 
I can build buildings though. What about here? You're a vassal, no, you're a French vassal. So that kind of sucks. So I'm going to go sweep all the way. Ah, sorry about that. Ah, okay, so I've got to sweep all the way over to Australia. Zoom out because it's much quicker. Ah, okay. So then if we pause the game again, we can get to some relations with Australia. Yeah, this is the most crucial part of the game starting off. If you don't get very good relations, you're not going to end up very well. Trust me. Um, I played as Greece once in this game. Well, I did not on my first playthrough. They are extremely hard to play as because you'll have Italy that always goes to war with you. Okay, what about all these? All these people are kind of like vassals. What about India? You're a vassal. Oh, uh, yeah, they're a vassal. But they kind of hate me. Yeah, they actually hate me. Wow. Okay. Sucks. Sucks to be them. Okay, everyone actually hates me. What about you two? No, I I've I've never played as a nation actually get to home with Tibet. Surprisingly. What about Ethiopia? Do you love me, Ethiopia? Do you love me, Ethiopia? Please say you love me. Nope, they hate me. Dicks. Under site treaty? No, they love to be dicks. Criminal extension? No, they just want to be dicks. Uh, free throw of labor? Or do you want to be dicks? No, you just want to like... No, they just like dicks. They love sucking big, juicy cocks. That's all they love doing. Hmm. They also mentioned sweaty. Big sweaty ones as well. Oh, formal alliance? No. They love me, but they apparently don't want a relationship with me. Well, said every guy ever. Free trade, come on. How, why would you not want free trade? You freaking love me. Look at that goodness. I have, This is ridiculous. Land of sight treaty? No, you apparently hate me. You know what, I'm going to leave it a while and hopefully they say yes. There we go. So we're going to leave it about a day. It does take a while sometimes. We just got to leave it a while. And then that's when I get all the friend requests come in. Okay. Regime. I don't really care about that. Um, it is historically accurate to an extent. Um, but after so long... Oh yes, I'm in 1936, so I could try and change history. So, so I do have a mutual defence, so that's good. Crimin criminal extension, though. I, I really want like max relations with everyone, but no one seems to really want it. No, I don't want that. So, uh, what about you, Sweden? Sweden, do you want a relationship with me, Sweden? Okay, we have to be wise. Mutual defense. No, you just want to switch big juicy cocks. Okay, air transit. Nope. Nope. Dicks. <sighs> what about you, Czechoslovakia? Nope. Nope. Why doesn't anyone like this? Nobody loves me. Nobody loves the UK. Oh, here we go. Nobody actually likes the UK. Wow. I am really surprised. This is never... Well. Holy crap. That's a lot of reserved units, dude. Okay, research team. What are you coming on? Research team. Okay, research. Research efficiency. Whoop. Research is really important. One million. Project development max. We are maxing you out, dude. Research spending. I'm unlucky one. Um, that one and that one you can do, dude. I don't really care about anything else. Uh, none. Keep that to a medium and low. So, yeah, I'm going to let him do what he wants to do. Uh, this dude, he, I, I'll just let him do what he wants to do. And this dude, for which one? Okay, so this is my government, so I think you can actually get it voted out. Support government of the UK. 
So yes, total espionage, medium, so we're going to leave you the same. I need to support my own government. Who wouldn't do that? Okay, I, I, get, I, I did get so far at one point that I could use this, but stuff kept happening and for some reason it was going all weird. Okay, play. I do apologise for that. And we zoom out a little. What about you, Ireland? Ireland hates me! The peep, the civil rating's good. Um, why do you hate me, Ireland? I'll give you alcohol. Come on. We can be best pals. We can automatically... No, we're not. We could go to war of them. Go to war of Ireland. But do I have any military units there? Probably not. Oh, hello. So, can I just, like, get all of them out? Yes, I can. So, if I get none, and none, none of them can, like, do what they want. And they'll have to do what I say. So, what about here? So, none of them can really go anywhere. So, if I transport a ton of them over, like, all of them to here, they'll all, at some point, go here. Wait a minute. There we go, everybody wants to be in Ireland. So yeah, shit's gonna go down in Ireland. Okay, what's this? Holy crap, what the hell was that? Wait, what the fuck? That's a bit crazy. Wow. Hello, Ireland. How many troops do you have? I'd totally bum rape you if I went to war with you. Yep, Ireland's totally going to get bum raped. <laughs> wow. Are you sure you don't want that alliance, my friend? Are you sure? Oh, hello. Who is that? Hello. Dip diplomatic offer. What do you offer? Yes. So I need to come up with a reason to go to war. Oh crap. Okay, so I didn't actually just declare war. Um, I want to condemn wars by this region. I want them to declare war on me though. So... I need someone to declare war on me. And the reason my... Oh, Greece. I love Greece. I'm... Okay, we're gonna, like, now we're gonna tell all these troops to go back into their wombs. Go into reserves. Now, they'll all reserve their self. At some point. So, if I go all over like that, everyone will let res reserve their self. Like that. So, now it just takes time. Just accept... Because then I'll get better rela relations with everyone. Hopefully. At this point, it just takes time. But I really want to go to war with them. But I can't go to war with them. It's really confusing how I'm explaining it. Keep me in. Hello, France. What are you doing in my borderline? Lutzenberg. Anyone here love me? Oh, Belgium loves me. But no, no, my look, they probably won't have any alliance with me. No, nope, they love sucking big fat juicy cocks. No, seriously, why doesn't no one want to have a relationship with me? Okay, is it because of the difficulty I've put it at? Okay, uh, escape. Uh, I do apologise, but this is ridiculous. Okay, map. Controls, files, graphics, this is none of it. This is not what I want. Um, my options. No, I don't want that. Reset options. Oh, crap. My options, really? General options. Okay. Map, controls, file. Okay. We need to make this bigger. Okay, I need that land thing. Okay, come on. Wow, the volume just got really loud. There we go, countries. There we go. Okay, that's all I want. 
is all I wanted. So, that, that, and that. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Military difficult. No, I just want diplomatic. I'm going to keep economy and military. So, we're going to make this very easy. Because it's ridiculous. So, we're going to explain that to hard and to hard. That, so, it, that balances it out a little more. So, has that stayed? Yes, that has stayed. It's only so it can help me. Sorry, my options. The music is a bit loud. Music volume. Still a bit loud, actually. Um, it could just be me, so I'm going to go back. There we go. Now we're going to carry on. This is so I can get better relations quite easy. Because I find that a bit ridiculous, to be honest with you. And they still have... What? What? I don't get this. They still don't want a relationship with me. Forced la labor, labor, uh, pact. Yes, they want that. See, so someone's accepting. What about you, Luxembourg? Netherlands, what about you? Non-aggressive pact. Yes, you want that. What about you, Germany? I need a slight relation with Germany. He might say no. Yeah, he's going to say no. Because Germany is that powerhouse that you don't want to fuck with. Okay, I need a big one with Germany this nation there we go I need a lot of relations with Greece and probably oh hello uh, I'll just accept because I need good relations uh, non-aggressive pact missile defense uh, free trade formal alliance which basically comes under that free there we go they're basically just going to accept on everything there we go that is so much more realistic that is way more realistic. Then the free form an alliance. See now they don't want to form an alliance, which really annoys me. You just have to click these. Um, yeah, it's pretty hard starting off. You just have to keep doing this criminal criminal stuff. Uh, what about you, criminal stuff? No, now Netherlands are being a bit thingy about this. Mutual defense, though. Yes, they will have that. They probably just want me to, like, ensure that they'll be safe. It's free throw of labour? No. Now I'm surprised at that. Because it helps there. Uh... They have a missile defence, though. Even though we can't really have a missile defence at the moment. That's for... Long way down the line. But it's better to have loads of people on my side. Um, if you accept all these things, you basically boost relations up with them as well so that's why I'm trying to do this you just have to do it one thing at a time it really helps see now they won't uh, line of sight treaty I mean I'll have line of sight treaty I just got to get Netherlands trust formal alliance we go for that yeah they'll go for that So I can max that country out. So I should be fine. So I'm fine there. And then I have to try and get a formal alliance with these guys. But they won't have that. So I might have to slowly increase it with them. See, they won't they won't go any further. So I'll have to leave that with them. Okay, what about you, Denmark? Come on, what about you? See, now they won't have it. It's really annoying. Non-aggressive pact? Yeah, they'll have that. What about you, Sweden? What do you have, Sweden? Mutual defence? No, now they're, they're really odd about this. Non-aggressive? Like, why wouldn't you... That's really stupid. They're next to Rush... They're, ne they're next to the Soviet Union. How can you be, like, on tipsy-turby with that? I just have to slowly do it with their neighbours then. What about you? Free trade? Yeah, you'll do a free trade. Mutual defence. Unaggressive? Yeah, that's good. Form an alliance? Yeah, they'll have it. They'll have it. They'll have all of it. 
And they're the leaders of the Union as well. The Nordic Union. So that's good. So they're going to say yes. All these countries will love me after, trust me. You have to know politics of 1936 to know it will help you, trust me. So, what are my relations doing with this country? Free trade? Yeah, they'll have that. They'll have that. Form an alliance. They'll go straight for it, yeah. Because Denmark is the leader of their union. What about you? They actually don't like me, and they're actually in the Nordic Union. So that's quite surprising. So what about you? Yeah, you just have to basically just keep accepting. Oh, Italy might like me eventually. So yeah, that's good. So I've made allies with pretty much all my neighbours. So now nobody can just march in. Other than the Netherlands. I need a form an alliance with you. There is a fascist regime right next to your nation and you don't even and you don't even care. Wow. They don't even care. Okay, this might take a while. I just have to keep slowly doing it. Very slowly. There we go. Now they might accept a full on um full transit treaty. There we go. Um, we're going to go straight for that because this way you can be more careful. They have denied me before. And if they deny you, you're in for a bad time because I'll keep on that offer for a very, very long time. See, they don't want to form an alliance. Free throw of labour. Yes, I'll have that and free trade. They'll have that. So I'll have everything but a form an alliance, which is basically what a form an alliance is. There we go. So now they'll accept it? They better accept it. See, how can you say no when I already have everything with you? That's ridiculous. Okay, this is, this is starting off non-aggressive. Non now they won't have that. Um, miss, missile defense? They won't even have that. Mutual. I doubt it. Yeah. Because if it goes yellow, it means they want you to pay them. What about you? They actually hate me more than Germany. Which is quite surprising. You actually like me, though, so I'm going to go try and make a relationship with you. I don't actually want to lose anything, though. See, now they won't have anything. Mutual defense? No. Okay, these guys look like they're not really going to like me. So what stars are you? You're four stars. So any country with four stars, I'm not going to go with. Now, Greece, you are a lovely country. Formal alliance? No. They're basically another Netherlands. So we're going to go you, you, full transit treaty, uh, line of sight treaty, free flow, labor, and then there. Okay. There we go. So now everything's going to go great. Belgium, no, they don't want to, and Turkey's being a bit ignorant, yeah, what about you Cyprus, now all my vassals are actually on edge with me, surprisingly, what about you British Palestine don't like me, all my vassals actually don't like me, gotta find someone that likes me surely, what about nationalist China, now they're an ally I want. One of these allies, Japan or China. They might actually not have a relationship with me though, because of yeah, it looks like they don't want 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 anything. Hmm. Mutual defense? No, that's strange. Because if I go straight in this war, this will actually help them. Just to help me with relationships. Okay, there we go, that's one. United States still don't want a relationship. 
Brazil? No, they hate me. Argentina. Yeah, they definitely hate me. Um, anyone? Is there anyone down here that likes me? I don't think so. No. Nope, nobody likes me. Wow. What about you, Ethiopia? You're very famous for liking British people. Oh, apparently they don't. But they do. Oh yeah, it, this is the country that love big, sweaty, hard dicks. Oh, they don't now. They they actually they actually like me. So I'll take that back. Cause they're actually good people. Okay, I'll take that back because they're awesome people. Mm. Okay, so nothing too much, I'd say. So that okay, anything to do with transit, non-aggressive missile and mutual defense all of that stuff okay let's go with some more so hopefully my relationships have gone up with them I doubt it though line of sight treaty nah line of sight come on you're the only other option and I'll have that see now it's like a gradual thing each country has its own little key point that you have to help out with. And with some nations, you have to actually do stuff. Yeah. And this is basically what a military battle looks like. It's nothing that great, but it's summer, I guess. I got the hope that they accept it, so then I can go up more relations. There we go. Sir, are you actually joking? You are on the brink of being destroyed and you can't be arsed to have an alliance. They are really fucking dumb. Oh my god. I hope they fucking die. Because I could go in and save them, but they don't they can't even be arsed. What offer do you want? Buy and consumer goods. Buy all my consumer goods. And if you click this button here, which I have just clicked on, it shall show you the treasury. So who's the wealthiest nation in the world? I am currently one, two, three, four, five, six. I am rank sixth. And I have one up here which is ranked quite high as well. So I'm doing pretty well. Population wise I am quite high. Um I'm quite high on multiple stages. So that's good. On the second one you have military units. I haven't lost any. But this is a good indicator to see where I am. So I'm quite good. I'm in a safe position. Pardon me. So yeah, everything looks good. Pardon me again. The man I've got really bad. Oh, what about you? Do you like me? Yeah, they love me. So let's try a relationship with these dudes. Democracy. Unaggressive? No. Mutual. Hmm. Him here comes the hard part. What about you, Poland? I could trick Poland slowly. Because if I get a mutual defence with them, Germany historically goes to war with them, and then that's how everyone gets involved. So if I go with someone who they hate, I should be in the safe zone. Just get a really strong relationship with Poland, and then I should be fine. What's this? Da Zing? Why? Uh, when was this a nation? Seriously, apparently that was a nation. Okay. So, that was a success. That's good. Alright, line of sight treaty, that would be even better. Free trade. Oh yes. They won't do a formal alliance though. That and that. Okay, so if we go there and then we'll try a formal alliance. That's strange. This bit of land I think belongs to Russia now. Or is it slightly up here? It might be slightly up here. Just gotta wait on them to accept. 
There they go, well, they've accepted. So now I can see where all their units are. So historically, Germany takes over all of this. Actually, no spoilers, and they send their units in. Poland basically gets screwed over big time. Oh, now they accept it. Okay, that's great. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Government upheaval? Okay, that's good. But government upheaval? By who? The government has become a dictatorship? Where? I'm going to condemn this. Nobody likes that. Wow. How evil. How very, e very evil. Yeah, all these countries are pretty much the same. So we're going to try and get a good relationship with these nations. Because it helps. Trust me. These nations are really good nations to get an alliance to. You might not think they're worth it, but trust me, it is worth it. Even though Italy was historically an evil nation, if you get good relations, relations with them, they might not declare war on you. That's a good part of this game. Okay, so if I get a relationship with this and... Russia basically goes to war with them. We could hold them off. Yeah, everything but a formal alliance would do great. Everything but a formal alliance. So, full treaty, line of sight, uh, free trade, labour. There we go. And then the same with this nation. Uh, full transit treaty, I guess. Yeah. Line of sight. And also you get to see where the enemy is as well. And where your allies' troops are. So everything actually goes really great. So now everyone's starting to love me. Um, like, he might not get on with anyone here, but he might get on with these. And then they will influence him to, like, me. From which... The good part of this is that nobody... They'll count, they won't cancel a relationship with you. Which is something I use to my advantage so many times. Okay, we're gonna click you. But this video is literally just about relationships and stuff like that. Because this stuff is very, very important. You'll see why in the future. In the war of the Pride. So what about formal alliance now? Yeah? Yeah, you'll take it. You'll take the bait. So I've got the hope they all show up green at some point. See, he won't show up green, so he he's an on and off ally. I, I might need this person, though. This might be, like, a crucial one. Yes, and he's going to go with me. So I did get a crucial ally. What about Finland? Finland love me. That is that is really good. That is extremely good. Finland are, are you, you have a lot of key nations in this. And if certain nations, like pretty much all of these states, don't like you, you're not in for a good day. Because if Germany was to declare war on Poland, everyone literally goes against Germany. So Germany would be absolutely pwned from the beginning. Because it's literally all these nations from the start. Which they didn't do in World War 2 if I believe so. If I think it was just literally. They knocked out this country and this country. But nobody really done anything. But if I'm allied with them. Basically everyone will just go straight in to start off with. And Germany might win. But because I'll just send all my troops down into France. Which I have a good relationship with. And all of these, I could actually do it. Because a lot of nations just let Germany do what it wanted. Oh, I can just go straight in for an alliance. That's great. That is awesome. That is that is just amazing. Thank you, F Finland. Okay. So I've got the hope Finland says yes. Because then... Next thing I noticed is Sweden will be surrounded by all my allies. Do 
Do you want an alliance yet? No, you don't. You might do when I get sw when I get Finland. Come on. I wish there was a way to speed this up, but there's not. There we go. Oh, you said yes. Yeah. There we go. Why haven't you said yes? Say yes. Come on, I want that to go green. There we go. Okay, that's great. I must have misclicked or something. I do apologise. And then we're going to get all these extras because that boosts up relations even more. I basically just try to max it out because it helps me in person. Come on. I'm just going to send this again because why not? Come on. You're not going to say yes. Nah, oh, that's strange. Form an alliance now? No, they just want to be assholes. What about you, Sweden? Come on, what about now? Finally, they'll actually say yes. Yes, okay, so I've maxed it out of them. And that's probably why Sweden are saying yes. Okay, just try and max this out. There we go. Um, so yeah, I started off with only just one nation willing to ally with me and now I've got a whole ton of nations in my local neighbourhood and beyond in Canada and Ethiopia. So I'm doing pretty well considering for the first 40 minutes. Uh, Sweden, no, I want to get a better alliance with and they don't want an alliance so come on just gotta wait a bit what do you want as uh, success that's good Ooh, success yeah there we go okay free throw of labor and a site treaty free trade there we go give it at least two turns one Come on. Just need to wait for that to go up. Two, three. Come on, Sweden. Reply. Don't leave me waiting, Sweden. Sweden's going to hang on me, isn't it? Well. Albania don't like me. They don't like me. And they pretty much don't like me. What about you? Formal alliance now? Will you? Yeah, they will. Failure? Okay, they accepted. Okay, they... Oh, they accepted. Alright. So that's great. I have an alliance with loads of people now. What about you? Will you say yes? No, you'll still say no. I'm probably still working on relationships with them. It's a bit on and off. I, it, they better hurry up, because otherwise someone's going to absolutely pwn them and it ain't gonna be me do I have max relations yet? I did with him in France not the Netherlands though, I really need a form an alliance Netherlands, there we go Luxembourg, what about you? non-aggressive neutral missile, okay I need it with all of these nations, even Luxembourg who have like, nothing So hopefully, there we go. So they've they've took the bait. Uh, full transit treaty. Oh god. They're not even gonna take that, are they? Nah, stuff is gonna get. Nah, this ain't gonna work out, is it? But I've got some up with them, so that's all right. What about Switzerland? Will you go straight for an alliance? You will. Wow. Unmutual. Well, I, this will change history for sure. For show. Sure.
What about you? You might. Oh, they don't want it. What about you? You might like me. Yeah, you like me. So we're gonna go for mutual. Oh, hello. They don't want to. They don't want anything to do with me. Okay. France do though, don't you? Yeah, they're 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 an ally. So literally all their vassals are with me. So Germany's pretty screwed at this point already. And they accepted. Everyone's pretty accepting my requests, other than Sweden and that other nation. What is it called? Uh, Latvia. Soviets don't really like me. It's pretty odd. Iran would actually go with me though. That's strange. Um, oh, these are just my vassals. So they pretty much have to do what I say. Yeah, they keep giving me money. So that's alright. I don't mind. If they want to give me money, they can give me money. Well, hello. Are you going to give me some stuff? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. This is great. China, the nationalist China, not the China we all know today, which is communist China. Okay, full transit treaty. Oh, no, you won't have it. Uh, what about criminal extension? I doubt it. Yeah, I can understand that. Free trades? Nah. I'm going to have to leave it a while with them. What about line of sight treaty? Nah. We're, we're, I'm going to have to leave it at that point um, for them. What about Tibet? Nah, they won't want anything. Um, what are your relations? You're French. You don't want anything. And you're British. So, that seems alright. What about you? Afghanistan don't want anything, apparently. Hmm. What about Iraq? Do you want to have a relationship with me, Iraq? Iraq and Iran would be quite a good ally. Even though I can't really see what I would do with them. That would be a pretty pointless ally. Um, what about you, Iran? Um, Non-aggressive? Mutual. Yeah, there we go. They'll, they'll, they'll have a relationship with me, Iran. Surprisingly. Um, I don't know very much history, but I think this Iran is uh, different to the Iran in the 21st century. It's, like, entirely different. It's really weird. A lot of stuff changed in the Cold War. It changed everything. A lot of things. Formal alliance, nah. Uh, full transit treaty, nip. You don't want that, nip, nip. Line of sight, nip. So they're going to be the same as China, but I got a mutual defence, so that's about that. So yeah, for this first part, I've actually done pretty amazing. I want to see what they think of me now. They, Ireland still hates me. Well, okay, fair enough. Um, well, I hope. Well, I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I shall see you in the next one. Bye-bye.